welcome Sagittarius to my channel Rainbow Wizard Tarot. Today I'll be doing a love reading for the middle of May for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Please keep in mind it is a general reading. Take what resonates for you and leave the rest. You can also check out other signs in your chart. I recommend a Moon and Venus signs specifically for additional love messages. And uh, thank you to all of you that have already subscribed to my channel, that are viewing my channel. Welcome to all of you new viewers. I greatly appreciate you all so very much and uh, sending you so much love and I hope you're all doing amazing. So Sagittarius, if this resonates with you, please like and subscribe and hit the notification bell. So let's see what does the middle of May have in store for you in the matters of love. Sagittarius. Oh, somebody is uh, thinking of you. That could be on a distance. There is a crossroad here. Somebody is making a choice, or maybe you are making a choice. You could be dealing with a fire sign. Um, certainly, there could be a geographical distance. It doesn't have to be. It can be emotional distance for the moment, but there is a choice being made, a passionate choice <laughs> and uh, to come towards you. So in the recent past, um, or someone will do. There is someone here that is very fond of you. They will be expressing their emotions. This is someone that can be quite charming, quite seductive. Uh, they are definitely wanting to, to uh, wear their heart on their sleeve for you, Sagittarius. And uh, they, um, you could be dealing with a water sign. Um, some of you could have water in your chart. They're seeing you as the person they want to give this cup of love to. They feel very emotional around you. But uh, they, uh, this person that could have recently walked away um, from a situation that to be able to come towards um, you. Perhaps there, this has caused a delay. So now, for you, that there is a cycle that has ended with them. Um, Sagittarius and the, it could bring a new beginning but this is very much a, a brand new cycle starting and uh, your person could be kind of fearing that you friend zone them because this is someone that wants to uh, <laughs> they want to come in to you know put their heart give their heart on a sleeve for you they want to like travel towards you kind of travel to calmer waters with you if you haven't been talking for some time uh, this person they do see you as their happy life happy wife they see you as someone they want to 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 have a future with they um if there has been discussion of relationship or maybe there was a relationship in the past where you discussed this and it fell through and now they want to get back to that but this person's fear that you have friends on them. They are rushing in there with a kind of steamy, steamy message. Um, they want to, there could be someone that's reaching out to you after they had a few drinks to, to get the Dutch courage. They have a lot of love for you. And this is someone that's very focused on, you could be dealing with a water sign wanting to um, express their feelings for you. They, are, they don't want to hold back anymore. Someone here is scared that you have completely friends on them and the cycle is well and truly over and that you're not wanting to have anything to do with them. This could be to do with a past conflict that happened with them. And uh, yeah, they're really fearful that, uh, you know, that is uh, that is the end with them. You could have had an argument or maybe there was words not being said. And uh, yeah, they've just been this hostile um, situation for a while. But yeah, they want to, um, in the past, so you and them could have been in a relationship in the past. Uh, you know, you were talking of uh, investing, maybe getting a home together or business together. It, it was, um, the communication was was you know, flying. The, they were blowing up your phone and then something happened um, where you felt the cycle has ended. They've they've kind of walked away, but they're very emotional. They they are fearful again. Of, I can feel your friends on them after a conflict as well. So, uh, yeah, this person in the past, they've just been very, very slow of, um, you know, pulling out the stops for you um, and you just got impatient waiting for them. So this could have been a complete end. You could be dealing with a Scorpio, but this uh, it could have been a complete end uh, that, you know, they they accepted kind of that something has fallen through, but still they have a lot of emotions. So they're coming back. <laughs> they, are, they want to come back. And now they are strategically planning how to how to to come back how how can they you know show you their emotions without you feeling that you know they are just completely friend zoning them because for you this is a you know it's like a death and uh you know it's a 
new cycle so they really have to put their best foot forward this could be someone in the past they were not giving um you like enough attention it was just very on and off you could feel that this person was also you know investing in others that kind of feeling but this person it could be younger than you immature there's a page energy and uh, here and uh, they want to really come into work on this connection with you it could be someone that you've met at work in the past or maybe you had a business together something to do with sharing interest perhaps and uh yeah they uh they're very scared of you friend zoning them and uh they're brewing on this seamy offer you here they come you could be dealing with a cancer they they are like kind of observing you kind of trying to look for the signs are you is there any uh you know have you got any feelings for them have you completely cut them off there this person could have been going through a divorce something to do with the legal matters but they're coming in <laughs> they want to have this justice with you and them and uh, you have um you have ended a cycle with them Sagittarius it seemed that you are open for new opportunities there could be you know a few people around you giving you attention wanting to invite you out but you're still stuck on this person you feel that this person deceited you they um they were holding back the truth um and there's nothing worse for a sagittarius are very truthful they <laughs> they want the truth and nothing but the truth many i know and uh you know there is something that they haven't revealed or maybe something came to light that you know of and, and you have cut them off this person is it could be dealing with the leo they are trying to pluck up the courage to come forward they have feelings for you they still want this higher level of commitment and uh it seemed like someone here that is uh re they want to clear clear their you know uh mess they have made their actions they want to rectify the actions now you are appearing as the empress you could be getting a lot of attention in the middle of the may you are and you could have like you know done something to your looks they really are glowing you know a lot of people are coming out of <laughs> pandemic uh, all of us are going to you know hairdressers and grooming this that and the other and you could have taken time out you could be looking amazing going to the gym detox and all that and you are getting a lot of attention and you're feeling good and this person is feeling small next to you they are the knight um someone that is loyal in their heart but their actions are very slow towards you they had this potential with you in the past uh, it was passionate it was a future and they sabotaged it by being deceitful to you and uh, this person they are just they want this reunion with you they want to celebrate with you this is someone that see you in their future they see you if they could choose they want they want to marry you they they want to you know uh, this is someone that could pull out an engagement ring out of the blue as well they want to whisk you away um they want all that but their actions are really slow now they have been taking a lot of time out because this is someone that is strategic now understanding that you have friends zoned them perhaps and they are worried uh and this could be because they haven't really showed any emotions or just you are kind of tired of then this non-action you feel flat and not really yeah you are just kind of neutral in i can sense but they are determined <laughs> that this is a soulmate connection perhaps you knew this a long time ago and they have come to the realization that it's a soulmate connection they see you and only you and uh yeah they can't i mean this this is someone that um uh, they want to put the past behind <clears throat> and uh they just they just cannot stop lo loving you you could be dealing with an air sign this person could have been kind of holding back their emotions very much so it's like they're holding this person is just holding on to their old ways it's a safe zone for them but they're realizing they cannot um they cannot pull these actions because there are so many spilled cups now um you could feel, see them as deceitful they see you as their soulmate you see them as a soulmate they want to get together but this is someone that because they've been holding back those emotions they they have to to come forward and this is what they, they want to do this is someone that they are finding the right time they're going to be emotional towards you and and, and uh, there will be a you know there will be a reconnection with you and them 
it's going to happen out of the blue i mean this is someone that could so here we have the ace of of wands they are very passionate i mean this is someone that's coming in for a steamy new beginning so it's almost like as they see you giving them the cold shoulder perhaps they had to make a choice perhaps this is someone on a distance and um they are waiting to kind of connect with you somehow. Perhaps they are waiting for you to maybe be out with your friends. Maybe they're sending you a message because you had a few drinks. This is someone that is trying to reach you when they feel that you could be receptive to their communication in, the, in an emotional way. So they know they don't really, you know, if you're busy at work and you could be someone that is very focused on you at the moment. They want like, they know it's not the right time to pour out their heart in the middle of the day. Like they are watching and lurking and waiting for or when can I strike? When is Sagittarius receptive to my emotions? And they will open up because they do not want to be friend zoned by you. They are petrified. They are petrified of being friend zoned. So, um, yeah, let's see what other thoughts, feelings, and actions for you in the middle of May, Sagittarius. Yeah, they want to be the emperor. Perhaps once you saw them as an emperor, you saw them as that future, the you and them could have made plans you could have even whether you were in a relationship or not or you could have just been even this this could have been a conversation that came up really early because you were you connected whether this is a situation or a relationship or what not there was a conversation about you and them like going places and you could be dealing with an areas and now they are they want to 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 come to conquer you they, they want to to win at all costs with you uh, they know they have just one last chance so this is someone that feel loyal to their heart they are they know they love you they know they want to be with you but this is someone that is taking their sweet time um very they, this person could be obsessive and jealous um they are they are very passionate about you if you have been physical with them they are stuck on you very much so and uh, they are making a decision because really they have to this is someone maybe that have to actually travel towards you. Perhaps even when they come forward, they really have to come with something concrete. That has to be an emotional offer with something tangible. And it could be even they have to relocate. So yeah, something tangible with a choice about a future. You with them is almost they have to like really pull out the offer for you uh, and connect with you emotionally for you to 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 have this attachment to them again because you kind of are holding back they are hurt but what happened in the past there there was also painful for them even though they could have caused that themselves due to their actions they they want to be with you and only you are their soulmate for some of them they made a choice there could have been a third party they were giving to two and now they want to work on this connection so i could see a third party interference as well they have been letting go this is someone that has quite a like they are like to go out, they like to flirt, they, they are this kind of character and then they met you and now you don't want any of that like lifestyle, that, that kind of behavior and, and you are giving them the cold shoulder and friend zoning them and now they realize like you are their soulmate. They could be um, leaving someone as well, there could be someone in the mix that was an earth sign that they you know they kind of juggled there could be someone codependent on them as well if they were in a connection but they want victory with you you are their their soulmate and they want to you are their happily ever after they are determined so this is someone that's cutting themselves loose strong areas energy to come towards you they got a wake up call it's you they want to be with i see for many of you that you have water in your chart they feel that you and them were destined to meet and they are really are waiting for this um lucky chance with you but this person is fearful of being left out in cold. They're rather sort of, it's almost like um, they are feeling that, oh, you know, I'd rather be in this kind of safe zone for a little while longer. But then they see you are the empress. You're getting all this attention. You will not be hanging around for them. You will be snapped up. Uh, and uh, yeah, they, they will be coming up the truth because they will not be able to, to, you know, hold back. Could be someone also that left someone or someone left them or they left you know a connection here that caused them a bit of a downfall financially maybe they had to move out didn't have like a deposit or something as well so uh, Sagittarius uh, what are your feelings thoughts and actions for your person in the middle of May what are your thoughts actions 
So you feel this person's very manipulative. And now we have the emperor again. So this is someone you've seen, like, you see this that you them could get, like, house and build. And, like, it's someone that um, you, you both were emotionally invested with. And also, you saw, like, this additional future that you could. And they disappointed you. Um, a strong Aries energy doesn't have to be. Um, and now this came out again. So, yeah, it was hurt here because someone was manipulative. Uh, someone that wasn't uh, showing their full uh, hand of cards, that's what you said. And um, yeah, they uh, you you see them as someone manipulative and up for themselves basically. Um, what are your thoughts, feelings, and actions towards this person and in love for May, middle of May? Yeah, you see this person as being like toxic, or uh, being like no good basically because this person was maybe they're in a third party trying to juggle. They were not truthful with you. They were could have been promising you this future, and then this ended. So this ended. The, it was like a planning a future. I see for many of you, or at least your hearts. Your you were very invested in each other. They kind of pulled the carpet under your feet. Something came to light, but so that ended, uh, and you could have seen this as ended, and you you're fine with it. You are manifesting something new, but you are seeing this person as not to be trusted and. But there is uh, communication coming in. Um, you see this person as being in and out. It doesn't matter if they see themselves as the emperor. You see them as in and out. You see them as leaving you out of the cold in the past. Now, you when they come in, you can be feeling quite trapped in your head. You see this person as... Uh, yeah, you do see this person in not a good light at all. You see them as being deceitful, toxic, could have addiction problems. And you sort of, uh, you cut them off. And now you have this full cup of love here you um you 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 want i mean when they come towards you depending on how i see this person coming towards you different there's been some time or there's going to be a type of communication so you could agree with them to um meet up talk but you view them in the same light and they know that this person you know they put you on a pedestal you are the empress but this is someone here that has to come forward with the truth and it seems that they're waiting for the right timing and they will reveal the truth they have to be vulnerable they have to be uh sincere and that's uh, that's from the cars this is what they aim to to be here but at the moment that's you, you haven't seen that side of them you see them as very slow in and out immature at the moment as well like you have gained a lot of abundance you could for many of you uh, Sagittarius have gone through a huge transformation as well you have leveled up in your life you could have sort of not focused so much on love for a while maybe this happened in the past it was hurtful you were healing from this and uh, now you're feeling strong this person wants to come back they love you they see this as a soulmate union you are you know you want to hear them out but you are not willing to sacrifice your empress status you see this, I mean, you will give them the time of the day because you see this person as, this is, could be 11-11 twin flame type of connection, that it's uh, something that draws you to them. It's a tie that is very strong with them. You could be thinking of an Aries fire sign, definitely. You, you see this person as very selfish and you just out for, for, for themselves but you want to hear them out it seemed that you have healed and you put like um a new you know you, you're starting up something new you are very strong you are feel very powerful you feel emotionally healed so you're not going to give away your heart now this person is someone now that's coming back they're going to pull out all the stops someone that has leveled up they could have been telling you about a divorce as well now this person wants higher level of commitment you want higher level of commitment also but with someone that is sincere like a king of cups so because you have been may taking this time healing you are the empress there is more than one option around you giving you attention and you are just sitting back waiting but there's there is something to do with an exciting new beginning something to do with someone that you might offer one last chance even if you feel a bit anxious uh, sorry <laughs> anxious <laughs> around that you could be giving this person like a, a chance because once once upon a time they were your wish fulfillment so i see this is something that's going to happen very fast there, you could have around you uh, someone here is coming in to be sincere there's an air sign there's a fire sign both giving you attention the air sign could be an aquarius um giving you attention here and there's something about someone coming back from the past different because of the tie the soul tie you have with them 
you will be hearing them out but it's going to be a shock when they come forward you didn't really expect it and you're going to make up your mind you're going to leave one of them behind and you are going to there is something to do with the destiny uh, coming through here so um it seemed that you will be there is something about an unfinished business with an old love um that is coming back uh it's like this person once upon a time you were that you wear each other's like future things well you know you get along really well you have you know great times you're very passionate you a sexual chemistry is through the roof you're very attracted to each other but then you know there was a painful ending in the past you've healed from it you have admirers around you you are holding back your energy but this person is going to pull out all the stops and it seems they've changed it seems they have cut out the third party which is the start and they are determined to win you over i mean there this is a soulmate union so you know it's no wonder that this is not ended so you've been staying optimistic about your love life and there could also have been this person could have keeping a secret there was children involved perhaps there is going to be well with all the cups here there, there will be a, a, a heart to heart conversation coming up and there could be then they are will be speaking the truth about releasing the ex or uh, a reconciliation this will be getting together ha speaking and reconnecting there is a past life relationship so you have a very strong tie it's easier said than done like sometimes you could feel that this person is kind of over you feel yeah i'm ready to start new but there's something about the pull this person makes you feel that you're just addicted to them they pull you in because this person is very very charming they know how to to push your buttons but they love you they do but they are not always acting with integrity and certainly they didn't in the past but you do deserve love this person is very attracted to you and uh, this could be the one this person wants to whisk you away they will be making the effort with all the cups so there is an unrequited quite a love situation on your side um Sagittarius that you will move away from with this person coming back um you'll be keeping an open mind you haven't seen them per person there you haven't seen that seen that person sorry I can't speak for a while and this person there was deception in the past but you seem they now have cut their um you know baggage they are coming forward without um the baggage they're coming forward with the truth so they could also be having to let go of these control issues you could be dealing with someone with a completely different sort of background uh, religion culture as well so um yeah they will be coming forward they uh don't want to be friend zoned anymore and uh uh let's uh see some messages here so uh, we have I like you so um definitely someone likes you there is a there is someone that is giving you also attention that is someone maybe also back from the past but someone that's been around you for a while giving you sweet messages attention right this is someone giving you making you feel good um and there's abundance coming around you as well so um you have a very positive mind set as well you're manifesting exactly what you want so you are the empress you you are building the empire and you're making healthy choices. I see for you as well. This is what you do not want to go back to something that is unhealthy for you. But here we go. So this you could be dealing with a twin flame. This is the tie you have with this person. Not all twin flame connections are healthy. There's a runner. There's a chaser. And there's a clearly that has been the, the case. So now <laughs> tables are turned. This is why you want to give this a chance. It's like a, a guilty pleasure. It's something that's not. Um, so yeah, there, there was a breakup. There was a separation um and you felt abandoned by this person uh, separating from a twin flame can be extremely painful so this person could have also been yeah codependent addictions obsession on their side controlling so this person could have released himself from a codependent situation uh, addictions were involved in so it was very unhealthy and uh, so this is like um you know extending as well transcending obstacles uh preparing yeah for a union so you know there is a twin flame reunion on the cards here and um yeah so in the past so with the red flags here as well 
there is someone here that was like a, a snake. Someone wasn't acting with integrity. And, and you are fully aware of it. You have a very strong intuition and you are waiting for them. You know what truth they have to say for you to, you know, look here, yeah, said the chaser. You know, this, this person now is the chaser. It's the table has turned. They want to get back in your good graces. They feel that you have, and here we have the hand of cards as well, like I said. This person didn't deal the right hand of cards before and they will now. And you will notice when they come in. And uh, so so basically this is a reply. They've been replaying like everything over and over in the head. Like they want to come in correct now. They really want to come in to um, rectify. But you will know when this person come in, uh, depending on what age you are in, where this person are at in their life. You will just know because now you are in a very healthy place and you will have no comes about cutting them out so we have also the north node here so stepping out of your comfort zone um sagittarius and uh, uh with with stepping out of the co comfort zone so uh so it's basically uh you could be like you could feel that facing the situation it could be fearful because it could have been a painful ending in the past but you got this now it's like where you're at, they will not be able to hurt you as you did before, but it's something to do with uh, you heading for something that you feel is destiny. So it's a pull towards this person. It's a pull for a reconciliation here. And this person definitely has gone through changes. And you'll be the judge of if those changes are uh, good enough. <laughs> and uh, uh, we have the uh, elephant. So um, the elephant as well. You could be, uh, some of you could be a Libra um, uh, dealing with a Libra, somebody you could be dealing with someone here of the ox or primal sign elephant as well. Um, so, so with the elephant as well, it does, uh, it, it comes to hard, it means hard work, fairness and intellectual pursuits. So uh, they have very strong bonds as well with family and close friends. So this could be the, the trace that you're taking on. You're very generous, diplomatic and very peaceful. Um, and um, you are also um loyal and uh, you have a lot of patience and wisdom and strength so these are the these are the traits that you're also looking for in someone the loyalty the truth you know that someone that is uh, you know a family person such as yourself is very very important for you Sagittarius so um yeah these were the messages for you for the middle of may Sagittarius if it resonated please like subscribe and hit the notification bell and uh, thank you for watching I'll see you soon